Scamper is a concept generation process that attempts to trigger new ideas. Each letter stands for a specific stage in the process. To demonstrate Scamper today, to you all, um, we will be using a design process for a product that Matt has taught us all to adore and love. We'll be using chairs. The first part of Scamper is to substitute. By looking for something to substitute on your product, you can often come up with new ideas. Oh my god! This chair sucks! Oh. Typical questions that you might want to ask yourself are, what can I substitute to make an improvement? What if I swap this for that and see what happens? How can I substitute the place, time, and materials, or people? Oh, this is much better. Great substitution, Michael. The next step is to combine. Think about combining two or more parts to achieve a different product. The typical questions you may ask yourself is, what materials, features, process, people, products, or components can I combine? Nice combination, Carson. The next letter is A. That stands for adapt. Think about which parts of the product or process could be adapted, or think how you could change the nature of the product or process. Typical questions you may ask yourself are, what part of the product could I change, and in exchange for what? What if I were to change the characteristics of a component? Nice adaptation, Vince. The next stage is to modify. Think about changing part or all of the current situation or to sort it in an unusual way. By forcing yourself to come up with new ways of working, you are often prompted into an alternative product or process. What happens if I warp or exaggerate a feature or component? What will happen if I modify the process in some way? Oh, not so excellent modification there, Taylor. The next part of the scamper process is the P, standing for put to other purposes. Think of how you might be able to put your current solution or product to other purposes. Or think of what you could reuse from somewhere else in order to solve your problem. In this case, Michael uses his chair to reach something up high. Another chair! Yeah. You might also want to think of a different marker, market for your product. Way to put your chair to another purpose, Michael. Yeah. The next part of Scamper is E, which stands for eliminate. The question you may ask yourself is, what would happen if I remove a component or part of a chair? How else would I achieve the solution without the normal way of doing it? In this case, Carson removed the unnecessary part of chair from the chair, which is a tree. Good elimination, Carson. The final stage in Scamper is the reverse or rearrange stage. Think of what you would do if part of your uh, process worked in reverse or was done in a different order. You can use this opportunity to discover different angles and come up with new ideas. Nice rearranging, <laughs> Michael. In short, the Scamper method is an excellent way to produce new ideas. Scamper! Scamper.